Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we have traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. The idea of the party is to celebrate our breaking or smashing of the world record for time around Long Island that I had previously set in 1989 at three hours and six minutes. Uh, someone theoretically beat it by one minute a year ago and about five minutes after they claimed to beat it I ordered up a new boat to get ready for this summer and this time we broke the record by 54 minutes so I think, I think it's pretty safe for at least a little while. I had had cancer in 1979, so that's knock on wood 33 years ago, and the boat is designed, and there have been 14 recovery boats, uh, were designed to win races, uh, to offer hope and inspiration, to show people that you can be sick and, and there are good endings to these things, or can be good endings, uh, and to raise money for cancer research. And every dollar that we've raised or that I've won has gone to the Don Monte Memorial Foundation where I was treated at North Shore Hospital. race he ever had, um, I was in a helicopter above him and he hit a wave and at one point he looked up at me and I looked down at him because he almost flipped over. So I thought I was going to lose him. So I wasn't very happy when he told me this and I did not want him to do it. And he kept telling me it's for cancer research, you know how I feel about this. I'll find the best person to be in the boat with me, but I need to do it because I feel it's something that I have to do. Knowing Stuart is sort of like this. You get up in the morning and you go, well, what am I going to do today? And Stuart says, how about if we try to recapture my record of speed around Long Island? And you go, okay, great, but I have a 10 o'clock appointment in the office. And Stuart goes, don't worry, we'll start at 6, you'll be in the office by 10. And I was in the office by 10 o'clock. The average speed was 124, 125. Going out to Montauk was about 143, 145. Uh, the ocean was rough. We slowed down to 100 or 95. In the East River, uh, we went underneath the 59th Street Bridge at 149. That was sort of fun looking up at the traffic. Every dollar we raise goes directly to cancer research. It doesn't go to pay for rent or advertising or, or silly stuff. Um, that makes it very, very effective. We've committed to the Don Monte Memorial Foundation $100,000 for this event. Um, I think we're probably halfway or, or a little bit more to it, and I've promised Mrs. Monte Saladino now that, that one way or another that we're going to get to the 100 if I have to do it myself. You looked at me and you shook your head, and I said, I looked at you like, what, what, what? you blew your record by 54 minutes. You were like, I want that 11 minutes. And you know what, Stu? That keeps you going, baby. Don't ever change. I'm 52. When I was in my 20s, my mother said to me, this young man, Stuart Hain, he has a desire. She put his hand on his lap and said, I lost my son, which was my brother. I'm not going to lose you. So Stuart has, you know, been such a connection for us. Everything that Stuart has helped us with goes into the Cold Spring Harbor Labs, where we do our research, goes into the North Shore LIJ Health System, and also into CW Post, where they've started new genetic labs, where they're training young students on how to pre pick up predispositions for cancers in, in their genomes. So we're working on many different avenues, but um, we're very focused, and we're very proud to have Stuart as part of our team. My right is Stuart's a great friend, and um, it's a great cause. We've all been affected and touched by this, and uh, if we can ever eradicate it and, and get rid of it, it, the world would be a greater place. And uh, even if you can't cure it, to try and detect it earlier, to have new science, you know, it's, it's important, and, and to do that, it requires funds, and every little bit helps. Everybody can make a difference. It's no big eyes and little U's. Everybody contributes. Everybody can, can make a difference. I 
I learned that we can all push ourselves a little bit. Just when you think you're at the, the end, the red, the red line, um, there's more to be had.